Thank you, Madam Speaker. I'm pleased to rise today to introduce two petitions. The first one um, signed by uh, hundreds of uh, individuals from uh, my riding in my area uh, in support of uh, an Aboriginal man who uh, they believe to be wrongly convicted. It speaks to uh, Mr. James Moore, who was accused and convicted of second-degree murder in a case where the Crown agreed he was nowhere near the scene of the crime, and when a trial determined he played no part in the crime. Um, as Mr. Moore uh, was convicted in 1979 by an all-white jury, which resulted in a 10-year uh, prison sentence and lifetime on parole, the undersigned of this petition call on this government to recognize that this was a wrongful conviction and overturn the conviction uh, and enter an acquittal. And the second petition that I rise to uh, introduce today, Madam Speaker, is uh, uh, the petitioners want the criminal code and provisions within the criminal code strengthened to prevent animal cruelty. Um, they're believing that the current laws are inadequate to prevent animal cruelty, that the criminal code provisions on animal cruelty haven't changed much since 1892, so the undersigned call on this government to present legislation to increase penalties for animal cruelty under the new section of the criminal code, extending protection to all uh, vertebrate animals and limiting the slaughter of stray and wild animals without lawful intent. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Uh,